Hello guys, welcome back to Gaming Tidbits. We're back and we're ready to roll. So we're going to talk about a story we talked about earlier this very year. Again, this year is coming to a close. It's wrapping up and that is 8-Bit Music Power. Now for those who don't know, 8-Bit Music Power was a chiptune music album that was released on the Famicom cartridge that you could either play by a Hound in a Famicom, a Retron 5, or some kind of Famiclone system. Again, a niche item, and anybody who loved 8-bit, obviously, music would love to have this. Well, luckily, now, 8-bit music power is about to be re-released on a traditional music CD coming out February of 2017 next year. It is up on Playasia for pre-order for $23.99 U.S. dollars. Uh, imagine there's also shipping to it. But it will be re-released. Not only is it being re-released, uh, it's also coming with a fully translated English language magazine that gives you information on the making of the tracks, interview with the artists involved, uh, features exclusive artwork relating to the album. So, not only do you get the music of 14 tracks, you also get, well, it's 13 tracks, but there is a bonus track. But you also get... The cool magazine, which looks really awesome, which you're seeing pictures of, obviously, in this video right now. Uh, again, this is a really cool thing for people who are fans of that music. I love I love 8-bit chiptune music. Again, there's something about that music that made the games better. Just something about that music that's simple, but is at the same time awesome. And again, if you love pixel art or chiptunes, obviously, between the magazine and this, this is definitely, definitely up your alley. It's not an incredibly expensive price, either. Uh, twenty three ninety nine, US, and it comes out of February, so it's after all the Christmas stuff is done, uh, and again, it is really, really awesome. I mean, I like this kind of stuff. I think stuff like this is really cool, uh, especially for the fans of the eight bit. And the, and the artwork in this magazine is just again, unbelievable. It looks so awesome, uh, and definitely be something you would definitely dig into if you got to see. For me, things like this. Why maybe niche are really cool. These are things that, reason why I make videos to talk about this stuff is I love things like this. I love bringing attention to things like this that just a lot of people just aren't going to talk about. Uh, not that they don't like it. They either not aware it's out there or they simply just don't think enough people want to. And I think there are a lot of people who want this kind of stuff. Uh, especially if you're into the Japanese artwork and of course this type of music. It's really cool. So, what do you guys think of 8-bit music? power book you know and the music all that's going to be out in one package with the magazine and the, and the soundtrack now on a traditional cd where you could you know listen to it when you want to or obviously rip it to your your digital music device and listen to it on the go is this something you'd be interested in that comes out of february or is it something you're like you know what that's cool but i want traditional music i want the video game soundtracks not this stuff you know, this is made by people who've actually made music for those video games. So, what do you guys think? Love to hear your guys' opinions. Unfortunately, my furnace is kicking in now, guys. I'll make another video soon. Later, guys.